Now let's talk about the comparison operators. These operators are used to evaluate conditions. Programmers refer to the testing or checking of conditions as evaluating the condition. First up is the double equal sign. This is the equal to operator. It checks if two values are the same. Right now you may be think, asking yourself, why two equal signs? In many programming languages, double equals means comparison. Are these two values the same? A single equal sign means assignment, which means assign the value on the right side of the equal sign to the variable on the left hand of the equal sign. So in that way, it becomes easier to understand where you are doing a comparison. Exclamation point equal. This is um, not equal to. This checks if two values are not the same. Triple equal sign. This operator checks that both the data type and value are the same. This means when we look at the number three and then a number three in quotes, these evaluate to the same value but they are different data types. One is a number and the other is a string. Exclamation point double equal sign. This is strict, not equal to. This compares two values so that both the data type and value are not the same. Greater than. Checks if the value on the left is greater than the value on the right. This works for numbers and strings. Less than. This checks if the number on the left is less than the number on the right. Greater than equal to. This operator checks if the number on the left is greater than or equal to the number on the right. Less than equal to. This checks if the number on the left is less than or equal to the number on the right. When evaluating a condition, it will usually consist of one comparison operator like the ones we mentioned, as well as two operands. The operands are placed on each side of the operator. These can be values or variables. These operands can also be expressions, as expressions evaluate down to a single value. 